50% of the people who watch my content are not subscribed. So if you aren't, consider it if you want to see more from me. All right, what's up, guys? Because always welcome back to another OV game, which is truly the Skyrender. And today we're against um, from the disco group Tiki Libby. And uh, <laughs> tough team, tough team. Um, honestly, like. There is uh, Cortana is eating this team alive, and uh, I think that's the like that's the wrap up. That's all it is to it. There's a tough team, tough mons. I'm a tough guy. I lose like a man. I have no idea what that means, but I mean, we have two really stolid Pokemon in Blissey and um, Sableye, which I don't know how much they can balance each other, but I definitely know I will struggle against them no matter what their set could be. Now, starting off with something like, say, uh, um, I was going to say Sekrom, but um, Psygod is going to help me potentially break the, the main leads. Um, but if the main lead is something like Sableye, then that won't matter. Or Landorus, I mean, Landorus is annoying. Demetros, that's a great name from Lando. I could, if I want to, actually just go straight off for a thousand arrows. But I will be at minus one. <laughs> That's a threatening aura or aura. So, what I'm gonna do is send in Gable because there is no way he has, uh, like, he'll you know, knock off, he'll have Earthquake, maybe Stone Edge, but that's it. So, I'm gonna get my Grass Surge, I'm gonna get my Boost, hopefully, he's still for Stealth Rock, staying safe. <coughs> yes, nice. And I can go for a very, very, very boosted Horror Leech if I want to, but if I were him, I would go into Cortana here. Or Zapdos. Yeah, Horror Leech still. U-turns, not into it. Won't do that much, right? Yeah, 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 yeah you did alright. Threatening Aura. <laughs> By the way, that Twitter group, um, Text messages with a threatening aura. Probably my 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 favorite thing ever. Oh wait, why is this a switch in? I stand corrected. Why is that a switch in? Maybe I was going to go for a wood hammer and ruin myself, which I think would be fair. Close combat here. Stays in. Right? Please the other way. I, you know what? I I take that. If I take I take that as a lead way. Damn, that's actually great. Now I can wood hammer if I want to. Huh. Saptos comes in, yeah. Yeah. What do I do against you? Pressure? Sure. Why not? Like a millionaire, which is great here. Um, I can set up my own set of rocks. Or I can hurricane. Kind of saying Garou. I like, what is the play? Like U turn, maybe? Hurricane? Possibly Thunderbolt and Volt Switch. Let's find out. I probably hurricane here. Oh! You're going to love this. Trust me. What you're seeing now is my normal state. This is a Super Saiyan. And this... This is what is known as a Super Saiyan that has ascended past a Super Saiyan. Or, you could just call this a just Super Saiyan 2. Oh, oh. Has... Um, what a useless transformation. You've changed your hair, so what? This! <laughs> What's he doing? Is to go even further beyond! Will you shut who is up, man? Listen, who is. <laughs> Got him! <laughs> 
<laughs> Denied. <laughs> Oh, motherfucker. Now I can't lose. <laughs> Talking about threatening auras. <laughs> I mean, the thing is though, like, Cortana still beats me. Like, there is... Uh, there is nothing I can do in theory. Um... I think it will always appear, and there, and there will be nothing to it. Um, uh, <laughs> oh, that was fun. Did not expect that. Willow, yeah, check, might. Um, I'm defogging here. The thing is, if I'm leveling here, he can just taunt me, or toxic me also. But usually these run, what is a foul play, um, or call mind, um, substitute with the Dark Pulse only, or Shadow Ball. Um, honestly, it can be anything, and uh, yeah, there's a taunt. There is a Stallbreaker set, which most likely... Let's think about this. Over Scorching Sands. I have no idea like what his move could be. Nightshade maybe. Foul play. Yeah. I have flame body, so that's a risk. That was a crit. That was a damn. I'm not even offensive. <laughs> so we got that. Which is nice. Oh yeah, I had a sunlight or a sun on my side. That was kind of unfortunate. So far blast. <clears throat> yeah, recover. Makes sense. It just... How much can he stall through this? If I were him. Or if he was him. Power Blast does. Yeah. Next one will kill you. For sure. Defogging again. Yeah. Bastard. <laughs> Got me. Because the thing is, I think like Blaziken comes in and it becomes rather problematic. He can just recover here. Um, and I think if I connect the Fire Blast, he actually lose the Sable Eye. It's gonna be a Disable Eye if I get it right. Come on, man. There I go. So Sable Eye is gone. So he doesn't have any stalling possibility, but since I'm not fully recovered, Cortana is gonna be. Um, Kind of threatening, honestly. I gotta kind of use my um, Demetras. I gotta use this kind of smart. Like, I think he just U turns and that's it. Like, any chip on me is good chip. Huh. I really want to lock myself into Ice Punch versus this. He's just gonna U-turn, right? If he knocks off, I'm actually in trouble. Oh, he's gonna U-turn. You know he's gonna U-turn. God damn it, no, I can't do this. <laughs> I can't take the risk, I just, I can't do it. In theory, Dallas is just a sack play as, as the whole. Let's see. Stone Edge, he has Stone Edge. Yeah, that's not great. He even got the crit on me. So, I'm getting off my rocks. I think he just Earthquake freely here. Oh. He is super defensive then. He's got rocks on both sides. Or he just scuffed. No, he's not. Goody. Didn't get the KO either. So. Blaziken is slower. Cortana is not. But is Cortana get plus in attack? Is he willing to take that risk? 
Cortana can also carry. Yeah, I'm gonna go for Equa. If he has Defog, he loses it. Small Strike. Yeah, nice. I really I just couldn't take the risk. I really mean it. Boost in speed, please. Be timid. Be weird. Attack ropes, damn it. Um So I am faster with Garug. But I really can't do damage on him. Yeah, I'm gonna do this. I think knockoff's gonna hurt me a lot, and I'm not sure I can survive it. If I survive it, I can roost through it. Withdraws, yeah, fair. To Landorus again. Which, by the way, means in theory that. Uh, huh. Like, if I really think about it, he couldn't. He possibly can't have a knockoff. So, getting this one fully workable is good. He's not gonna earthquake, he's not gonna earthquake, he's not gonna earthquake. Stone edge, stone edge, stone edge. Yes! Miss! Yes! Get him, get him, get him, get him. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Stay in, buddy! Stay in! <sighs> coward! Coward! Cortana! I was still gonna do. Okay, damage. Plus, we're faster. <laughs> eh, no, no, that's actually awful. Would be nice if we could switch to bonded press, yeah. Um, yeah, I mean, he asked me on the ropes. His good play is basically calling my, calling my place. I can assume it's probably Scarfed. Sacred Sword. Bounce that off. Flame Body! Damn it. Alright, Fire Blast. Um, like, Blaze can not come in and probably start breaking havoc. Does bring the Lando. Come on, Connected Fire Blast. I, I kinda need something to go my way here. Come on, Moltres. I know you should have been flamethrower. I know. Damn it. Damn it, damn it, damn it, damn it. I've yet to switch this guy in, too. Like, I know Tapu Bulu is kind of wasted for the matchup anyway. It won't beat Blaziken. It won't beat Tapu Guy. I know that. I just need this guy to stay in. I'm gonna go for close combat if he decides to go for a Stone Edge here. Or Earthquake. Stone Edge. Goody. And it does... Fair. It does actually very fair. Because do he... Does he want to lose to Lando? That's the question. Like if I were him, my U-turn. Yeah. So, Cortana, please. Cortana, please. Please, Cortana. I need Cortana to come in. I need you to think this is a play to make. I know what you're going through. I understand your struggles. <sighs> Damn it. That's Blaziken, though. Let's see how much this close cover will do. Yeah, 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 we're in this. We're in this. So, if I were him, what would I do? Flare Blitz, right? Sack play it with Flare Blitz. That's the play. That's what I see you doing. You gotta do it. Yeah! Nice. So we got this one sacked. 
Oh, he actually managed to revive that. Oh, damn, my four bows are just like a roost. Okay. So... We're in the end game now for sure. Like, I can't stomach anything he can throw at me. Right now, I think... Yep, sending in Gabulk. Basically, Tepagulu can't do anything versus this matchup. If I were him, I U-turn. Hopefully I die to that. He keeps stone engine like he is. He is feeling that, if anything. Alright, so I showed him that I had uh, Ice Punch. So I'm gonna body press this time. <laughs> oh, he stays in. I beat this guy. So he's gonna do okay. Oh, it had citrus. So that's not alright. Too very quick. It's gonna be reduced, but it's gonna kill. If I go for ice punch there, I would have. Damn it. Attack what is in front of you. Don't overestimate or don't overprotect. Let's see what range we got him in. I kinda need to spam these thousand arrows. We are not looking stellar. I think Earthquake can kill. Um, to be honest. But this is my like most solid play right now. Yeah, because it's super defensive. Here comes real quick. If I muster this, then we could have an interesting last matchup. As it's turning out great. This is turning out a very good game. At this point, we're both winners. I just realized I haven't done a match yet. <laughs> hmm. Maybe. Moltres really was an absolute champ though. She held through. She really did. At this point, Cartana is just a footnote in this matchup. And here is where we find out whether or not it's scarfed. <clears throat> because if it isn't... Then... It's not scarfed, okay? It's not scarfed. And it's also dead. Never mind. Oh, that was a good game. Fuck. Oh, to my opponent, I really mean this. I really mean this. Tickly beat. Fuck. Well done. Absolute threat. Uh, so anybody, anyway, thank you for watching, guys. I really hope you enjoyed the Aggron week. I'm sure we got some good games out of Aggron. I, I was happy with its performance. Also, special thank you to Notorious Titan who helped me with this set. Um, with that said, guys, as always, thank you for watching. I hope you enjoy what I did here, and uh, join us next week where we'll see what, which Pokemon we're going to use then. Till then, as always, take care, everyone. Bye.